Oh yeah. And yeah, the Night Elf one is really easy to get. Yeah, and it's Night Elf. Uh, it's as well on. Um, I just did this quest where I was shot out of a cannon towards a boat, and it was like, all right, you just went going down because you flew more than 65 yards. That achievement used to be a little bit hard, but now it's just everyone just gets it just by doing a quest. Yeah. Alright, Kaleran the Annihilator, come here you. Come here you, and die. Dragons, dragon thing. Die, go Gilblin. Die, die, die. Opening extra pure blasting powder. Because that sounds safe. Yay, the wrath of a dragonfly. Yay. Oh yeah, you, you know. Achievement earned Badland Quests. Yeah, Badland Quests. That was easy. Really fun quest. Yeah, there are more quests than uh, the achievement needs, so. What's the shield? Oh. Uh, oh, Stack of questionable publications. Improper. I don't want to know what that is. <laughs> Holy crap, already respawned? Jeez, I was just here. He missed you. Yeah, apparently. And I will show you how a paladin will beat your ass up. You Stupid wannabe goblins. You damn gilblins or whatever. Alright, now let's go back. Gilblins, yeah. I'll get in and fire it. What could go wrong? Everything? Yeah, probably. I'm back everyone. Alright. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Crazy Larry. Um, uh, sure. Give me the high grade griefs. And the next quest it is Baba Bog Brew. Uh, a little crazy. Baba Bog Brew. Well, well, well. The names are getting more interesting and interesting. Lil Crazy Daisy. That's one hell of a name. Your dad says to fire me across the bay. Alright. Here we go. <laughs> and I'm burning. You're flying through the air, on fire. Hope that parachute works. <laughs> oh, it did. <laughs> parachute worked. Lucky us. Baba Bug Brew. Hello. Slay Murlocs. Dark flight train spawns. What are you writing? A fell stalker. Awesome. <clears throat> Great, I just get one quest to kill Murlocs. Yay for the Murlocs. More Murlocs for the Murloc throne. Oh god, someone else is busy here. There's a troll hunter, level 59, running around doing the same quests. Aha, so we have competition. Now you have competition here. He's killing my murlocs. I should be killing my murlocs. Luckily they are murlocs. They just pop up everywhere. Uh, almost instantly. <laughs> no, not that, but they pop up everywhere. There's usually about a thousand of the damn things, so... Die. Die, 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 die. A balanced war axe. I remember the moments where we could just pick up a grey item and it was better than what we had. <laughs> Not anymore. Sadly, in one way. 
Triple six. <laughs> it's what? Sucks. Sucks. Okay. What did you understand? Understood. Well, just replace it with an A or an E. It just it sounded um, wrong. Let's just keep it at that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, good God! Die, you damn freaking Murloc! Oh, I can't wait to be in Outlands. Well, I actually, in in a sense, I can wait. I don't really like Outlands, but. <laughs> Uh, oh, it's pretty awesome, though. I think it's, I think it's more fun than Northrend. Uh, but it really depends on um, where you are. I mean, in Outland, was Northrend to find out. Yeah. Outland, I really like um, Terra Forest, Shadowwood Valley, uh, Netherstorm. Netherstorm is pretty awesome. I've done it once, sadly. I would have liked to do it, done it more, but. Um, you don't really get there anymore these days. So I did. Uh, I do like some areas in it, but just the starting area is just. Uh, we said it before. It's just yeah, terrible. The, the starting area is a bit boring. Yeah. So I'm. I'm not looking forward to that, but I'm looking forward for a change of scenery because Azeroth eventually starts to look the same everywhere. Yeah, and that's the same with Northrend. Yeah, of course it's from Azeroth, but still, it's just the same. Yeah, yeah, and that also eventually starts to look the same everywhere, and except for like uh, Shorazar Basin, which looks really cool, but you don't really get there, not anymore. So yeah, I, I, I think I would likely, I would love to go to Drenor now. Take me to Drenor, please. <laughs> Just instantly. <clears throat> Who is in front of this stuff? I, I'm dealing with an enemy. Oh, it's a lost one. That's why. I, I'm walking through a cave with enthralled uh, crustaceans, and enthralled nagas, enthralled murlocs, enthralled gilblins. I was like, who in the right mind has done that? But then I saw it was a lost one. It's like, oh, yeah, they do that. <laughs> That's old gods for you. They do that kind of stuff. I'm running the wrong way, aren't I? I think I am. Now we so about the old gods. We did kill two of them, Katoon and. Uh, we didn't kill them. Jokster, ah, well, we we kind of dealt with them. We dealt with them, yeah. You can't but, kill old gods. Uh, yeah, uh, Jokster one or Jokster one and Thingy, Katoon. Yeah, we dealt with them. And we still have two others, right? Uh, yes? Question mark. I'm not entirely sure. I think it's true. But I think it's true. They could do something with the old gods, I guess. But maybe a little bit of a cop out. You can't uh, you can't beat them in the end. That's just the thing. You you want to have an enemy you can actually defeat. That actually just disappears forever. But old gods always come back because. The old gods can't be killed because if old gods get killed, Ezroth gets turned inside out or whatever confuted, confuted thing they think of. So I don't you, know. You big ass freaking dragon. Big ass dragon. Yeah. That's uh, a great question, know. actually. The dragons. You have the the Chinese-like dragons. In Pandaria, and we have our own dragons. Which ones are the true dragons? Because we have two entirely different types of dragons all of a sudden. Uh, uh, because I hate Miss Pandaria, I will say that we have two real dragons. <laughs> Is that a fine answer? Or do you want a real answer? Uh, well, you know, if that's your answer, it's your answer, but um, it's still it's still a bit of a question, though. It, I mean, True. which one is the real one? Um, yeah, <clears throat> we just don't know, I guess. I mean, yeah, we. That's the thing. I I guess we just don't know. No, that that's. 
I, uh, why the hell did they put that in? You know, it's like, alright, we already have dragons. Why do we have different dragons all of a sudden? Because they are called the dragons. It's just, uh, look in your mount, it's like the serpent cloud. It, they, they call them serpents, actually. They don't really call them dragons, do they? Serpents. Uh, they, they call them serpents. Yeah, they call them serpents, yeah. I guess they're all three, uh, three dragons then. Well, that renders my question moot. Moot. There's nothing to talk about then. <laughs> about that. They are serpents. They are not dragons. Serpents are still a different thing, of course. So, yeah. Yes. I'm fighting serpents right now as well. They do not have um, anything else than wings and tails. But whatever, I guess. Yeah. I just started thinking about that, like, yesterday, it's like, why do we have more dragons? But, nah, apparently they're serpents, they're not dragons, so... Well, My rip mistake. Question. Rip question. Yes, rip that question. We are, we're not going to talk about it, forget it ever happens. Or, or something. Uh. But it was, was a really weird thing, like, so we have the, the, the five... Like power dragons, the the um, the dragon aspects, and that they yep. said they would put in new dragons. Like what? Yeah, those that would be a little bit weird. Yeah, but it would have been really awkward. That's why it came to mind. It was like, what? Wait, why? <laughs> why do we have certain like multiple dragon swords? We we already had the proto drakes, which were the basic so version of the dragons. So speaking about dragons in World of Warcraft, what's your favorite aspect then? Favorite Oof. aspect. Yeah. Oof. That's a great question. Yeah, th that I'm asking myself, I'm really thinking about it as well at the moment, because every aspect, including the black black, uh, black dragon flights, yeah. they have something really cool, like black, black is more about death and destruction. Well, black is mostly earth wardens, so they are the, the warden, warders, wardens of earth. Or well, they yeah. used to be until that thing became yeah, corrupted. Yeah. You, there's no mercy. You will burn for this. Blah blah blah. Grip we are dragon thingy. And of course, uh, the red dragon flies for uh, for life. Life, yes. Yes, life. Blue is um, magic. Magic green is dreams, and then we have the bronze. What is that? Is time. time. Do I miss anything? No. Those are the five. Uh, Five aspects. Now you've got Twilight, but that's not a true aspect. Yeah, because of Twilight as well, yeah, true. But I have no clue what they are doing. Um, Twi uh, Twilight isn't a true aspect, it's just a um, creation from um, Nathvarian. Ah, okay. Uh, and, and they are just. They are Twilight Drakes. They do exist, yes, but no. They, they don't add anything. Alright, fair enough. Um. <clears throat> so, every aspect has their own thing, which is pretty awesome, of course. Yeah. And I think that I'm going for the red one, I think. Yeah, uh, Alex Strasse is pretty awesome, of course. It's, mm. it's hard to really put up like one, I think. I mean, even... The, even though Deathwing was the corrupted bastard that he was, mm -hmm. uh, it still uh, he had he had something going for himself. True. So yeah, I'm not entirely sure. I'm I, I'm not the biggest fan of Ysera, so I guess that one already get goes away. You know, I, I'm not entirely. I don't really think the green dragons are pretty cool. So I th guess those are gone and out of the picture. Yes, it's the same thing with I, I, that I don't play a druid. I don't like it. Um, and considering uh, the greens I, I are... Not, I was not arguing about that. No, <laughs> I know. I was arguing about the quests. Yeah. Ah. He has lost egg. Ah, yes. Yes, the last oh, It is a trinket. Egg. Yep. And it summons a dragon. Yeah. Okay. I will keep that egg forever. Ah, I've done the same. I still, I'm still keeping it. Just because it's the uh, on it is like, please take care of him for me. It's like, why would I sell it now? You know, sell it to a goblin here. <laughs> take this dragon egg. I don't care. I fun with it. I don't want the dragon. Yeah, I find the ram up, and I'm done with all the quests, I guess. 
Yeah, that's one of the lost ones. Um, I maybe blue. I I do have a fun thing for Kalegos. I think Kalegos is pretty awesome. Yeah, Kalegos is pretty awesome indeed. The si yeah. I mean, he just had to take the position from um Malagos, Malagos who just went insane as well. Yeah, like he, he went mental. Holy fuck. Yeah, <laughs> no one should have magic except for me because you are misusing all the magic. And he was right in a sense, yeah, but yeah, he was right. That's the beautiful part about it. Yeah. He was a little bit mad in the end, but you know, with Kalegos having to cre recreate the entire blue dragon flight pretty much from the ground up, because almost no blue dragons exist anymore. No. It's, it, I don't know, it, 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 it's pretty nice. I think that's he has a upper hand in being one of the more uh, awesome ones. Mm -hmm. I am thinking if, I, if there's anyone else. I mean, I think Alex Strauss is pretty awesome. In the end, she doesn't really do that much. Well, in uh, Northern, she's doing some stuff. Yes, in Northern, she does some stuff. That's true, but um, beyond that, that, she she is, I think, the de facto leader of the uh, all the dragon flights combined. Yeah. Um, good question. I think it is. Yeah. I I think she is. Yes, Not I've truly seen. the leader of every dragon fight, of course. We, she's only the leader of the red dragon fight. But I yep. think if the dragon fights combine together as one team, yeah, usually they, Alex Strauss yeah. has the one that talks with everyone. So, screw that, screw that. Uh, but you know, she she is pretty awesome. But no, I think it would be either the blue dragon flight or the bronze dragon flight. I do like uh, Nosdormu. Uh, he is just. Also because of Morizant, to be entirely honest. I mean, just having the biggest enemy we are fighting being uh, Nosdormu himself. That was just yeah. awesome. You know, that, that idea is pretty cool. And I just found a uh, blue item, actually. I found a chest which dropped Soul Keeper. Ooh, that actually looks nice. pretty nice. But, um, yeah, I think those two are... Uh, I think those two are really close together. And... Not sure if I would put bronze up or blue. I really like Lagos though. Yeah, I yeah, think it would be blue. Awesome. Yeah, I, I think it would be blue. Okay. I think I will still keep it on uh, red. Yeah, it, it's it's it's, it, it's like I said, Alexstrasza has really something going for her. It's just not my favorite, but that's not a problem. <laughs> no, abs absolutely not. That's why I, I ask it. I, uh, I don't care if you were not agreeing with me. No, exactly. Everyone has uh, their own uh, opinion, right? Yeah. No, so uh, yeah, that's it. I think it's it's going to it has to be blue. Yeah, I mean he has to he had to regrow an entire freaking flight on his own almost. Sure. You know, no one, sure. a lot of blue dragons didn't agree with him becoming the aspect. And, you know, it was pretty cool. And, of course, pretty close in second place is the Bronze Dragon fight. I just like the uh, most normal, just the, the wisdom that he has. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the fact that he did not go crazy in our timeline, even though he knows when he is going to die. It's just, wow. Yeah. You should, I think many people would go crazy if they knew when they were going to die. Yeah, most people will, I guess. I mean, yeah, I would, to be honest. Yeah, I would too. I would. I would. I would be. Yeah, I don't know. I would go crazy in that if that happened to me. It's like, all right, you know, in about fifteen days and three hours, you'll be dead. Uh, then I would probably be going crazy, like, oh my god, in so many days I'm gone. I don't know. I I I I'm, I would go crazy just Good luck. just as easily. Uh, no, I'm not gonna take that quest from you. To Stone Arts. All right, thank you. And of course, so, uh, Nosdormu. Uh, seeing Gorge now, by the way. Oh, nice. Yep. Well, you're still not that far behind. You're still like one zone behind me. Yeah. Or one and a half now because these zones are pretty uh, short. Um, 
No, but uh, eventually even Osdomo went crazy because otherwise we wouldn't have Morizond uh, running around. So, or at least I guess he's already dead now, Morizond. Yeah, oh, Morizond is dead. Nosdormu, but evil. The uh, infinite oh. um, dragonflight. Uh, have you ever done the quests? Oh, quests. The dungeons in... Um... The, in Cataclysm, yeah. I've done them, but it's it's been a while, so I have... Yeah. Uh... I'm going to do them again, because I don't really like the questing line from Cataclysm itself. So I'm more about the dungeons. Yeah, yeah. And... Uh, except Mount, uh, Mount HL. That's, that one is pretty awesome. But... Um, no, I, I was more going towards the dungeons in the um, Caverns of Time. Yeah, Caverns of Time, yeah. Yeah. Uh, awesome the inf really the infinite, infinite Dragonflight is, is Morizond, Morizond is Nosdormu, and I think we killed him in... Pandaria? No, no, we killed him in Cataclysm. We killed Morizond in Cataclysm, so there is no Morizond anymore. So no one is playing with time anymore. At least that's what we think. Um, and hope. And hope, yes. Uh, so, yeah, he is already dead, but he did go crazy in one of the timelines, you know, with knowing when he is going to die. It's, it is already stated that he went crazy just because of that.